Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In the last video, I have shown you how to do a standard DFT calculation of tensile state of nickel monoxide. And uh, in this video, I will show you how to add a U term and do a DFT plus U calculation. So, um, as last time, I will not really do the calculation here because it's a little bit time consuming, but I will show you what is the input files. Um, so the, for the self-consistency self uh, calculation step, everything is the same, it's just that we add these three lines here. So uh, LDA plus U, so this means that we want to do a DFT plus U calculation, and uh, th this means that we set the Hubbard U of uh, the first type of atom and second type of atom to be 7.6 electron volt, um, and, uh, and the first and second type of atoms are nickel. So basically we set the on-site Hubbard U of nickel atom to be 7.6. And um, so, so this I take from literature. And um, so, so in the literature, there can also be different uh, choices of uh, Hubbard U. Usually it is like uh, below, below eight electron volt or below nine electron volt. This is the usual uh, range that you can choose. And there are two ways to, to choose it. One, one is to uh, treat it as a parameter to fit the um, experimental uh, result. Another thing is to, uh, to actually calculate, uh, calculate uh, from ab, ab initial calculation. Okay, and then the second step is the non-self-consistency -self calculation. And uh, still, you need these three uh, extra lines. Everything else is the same. And then for the densal state calculation, it is the same as uh, last time. And uh, for the plot densal state, uh, this is also the same as last time. OK. And then we just run the plot densal state. And here, what I would like to do is to also uh, do a screenshot. here and we also want to measure what is the band gap so it's uh, 12.9487 this is uh, 16.4467 So this is 3.498. Okay, so you see that uh, last time the band gap was uh, 0 0.8 uh, electron volt, and this time is uh, 3.5 electron volt. And this is also uh, similar as, w as what I found in literature, that with a standard DFT, you, um, the band gap is largely underestimated. And the experimental value is around 4, 4.2 electron volt. So DFT plus U uh, is like actually improves the uh, the estimation of the band gap. Okay, so um, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time.